Oh my god, you guys, are you serious? This is so freaking cute. Let me show you how small this actually is. Oh my god. <laughs> hey everyone, it's Carlos here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. All right, so in today's video, we are going to be unbagging my new shipment from Ipsy in the regular glam bag shipment. So if you want to know exactly what goodies I received in here, maybe test out a few of these products, then you got to keep on watching. But before we get started on that, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell as well. So anytime I upload a new video, you automatically get the notifications and give my video a thumbs up while you're at it. Because as always, I greatly appreciate it when you guys do that. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and get the sucker unpackaged. Or, yeah, unpackaged. <laughs> I wanted to recorrect myself and say unbox, but technically it's not a box. All right, you guys, I'm having a squirrel moment. Let's just go ahead and get started. All right, you guys, so dun, dun, dun. let's go ahead and get this sucker open. That was pretty easy, actually. All right, so we got the, we got the, we got the, <laughs> I'm hearing music in my <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Anyways, you guys. So we got the informational card. Is that info? Is, 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 is that even a word? Informational. I just made it up. Anyways, we got the card that tells us exactly what goodies we are going to be receiving today, and our variation and the price point of each of the items. Special. All right, you guys. So let's take a look of the actual Ziploc bag. Did I just call it a Ziploc bag? <laughs> <laughs> the cosmetic bat. Oh my goodness. I'm telling you, if you're new to my channel, bear with me because I'm, I'm I'm special. All right, you guys. So thoughts and opinions. Um, I do like it because it's orange. But when I do look at this visually, you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Coach because Coach has like these wristlets where they have like this leather like stripe in the middle of their like pattern. And they usually have the words Coach right here. Is it just me? I feel like that's what it reminds me of. Anyways, enough of this. Um, it does have a little smell to it, I'm not gonna lie, but that's usually how it goes with um, a vinyl type of material. But this is actually kind of cute. I'm not gonna say it's not. It, it, it actually, it is. I Again, if you saw my um, bagging, I was about to say unboxing, unbagging my, my November Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, I did mention that I wasn't at one point crazy about animal print. Now it's now I'm kind of enjoying it. Anyways, you guys, enough of that. Let's go ahead and see exactly what goodies we received because I don't want to scare you guys away. <laughs> All right, you guys. So the first product I pulled out, what is these? So, okay. So, sorry. Uh, oh, this is from Benefit Cosmetics. So yeah, Benefit Cosmetics. It says that they're real magnet, magnet, Mascara the word didn't want to come out. So obviously this is a deluxe sample, but if you were to purchase this um, Full size it would retail for $27 Um, just a regular mascara. I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't believe I've ever used a benefit cosmetics Mascara before all right, you guys so let's go ahead go back and tell them my bag of goodies and see what else we received <laughs> I, I forgot my medication <laughs> <laughs> no. Anyways, you guys. So the next item that we have here is from the brand called Mark Anthony Coconut and Shea Hydrating Leave-In Conditioner. So this is obviously a deluxe sample. This is actually a pretty good size for a deluxe sample. I can get some good uses out of this one. So if you were to pick up their full size, it would retail for $9. All right, you guys. So let's see what else we received today. <laughs> Sorry. All right, you guys. I tell you. Um, so this is Basic Skin, a strawberry lip scrub. This is a full size, and it does retail for twenty dollars. Let me give you a close up. Hopefully, no, you're not able to see it. Huh? I am kind of curious though. Let's take a look. Oh, okay. This the scent smells like strawberries, but like that artificial strawberry smell. You know what it smells like? You know, like those car fresheners that has strawberry scent. That's what it smells like. All right. Uh, I will tell you though, I'm assuming it's sugar. Mm. The little, like the hydrating of it. That's why I made the sound. Anyways, uh, the sugar, I'm assuming, scrubbies, rocks, whatever is in there, sand, you know. Um, it's actually pretty fine where it doesn't feel like it's hard and abrasive. So this is actually really nice to be completely honest because some lip scrubs can be very abrasive like after you get done like scrubbing your lips and you feel like they just been torn apart 
This not so much. I'm actually happy I got this. All right, you guys. So the next item we received, um, dropping stuff. All right. So I remember choosing this actually. This is from Juicy Couture. Choose Juicy. Now the reason why I end up picking this is because it's a candle, and I was curious as to what size this would be. This is actually kind of tiny. Hmm. All right. It smells actually kind of nice. I do have a candle, like, uh, not candle, but like a, a lighter here. So let's go ahead and test this out. <laughs> Get out. Let's go ahead and test this out. Um, don't breathe, Carlos. Let me just... Hmm. It does smell good. I'm not going to say it doesn't. I just smell burn. Um... It doesn't work this way, Carlos. Why am I even doing this? All right, you know what? Let me put it in the back over there. So maybe we can get a sense of the next product and see if we smell any aroma. That probably makes a little bit more sense than trying to sniff it with the candle burning. <laughs> All right, you guys. So the last and final product. All right. Oh, what is this? <laughs> Ooh, what is this? I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I sometimes I crack myself up. All right, this is such a really cute. Wait, I have I got something from this brand before, uh, not too long ago. Yeah, they're right here. Look. Why am I so happy? <laughs> because I got something similar from this brand before. Ugh, can't talk. Um, so I got these in a boxy charm shipment. These are pretty much like lip oil bombs. I actually like them. I don't like the scent, but I do like them. Now it does obviously is a deluxe sample, but if you were to perk perk pick up the full size which i'm sure comes in a palette it does retail for 16 dollars this is actually really nice not gonna lie all right you guys let's go ahead and do some swatching normally i don't like do swatching but i'll go ahead and do it today um because the reason why is because you get more of a payoff in terms i shouldn't say payoff but you get more of an idea of how the formula is going to perform when you actually use it versus doing swatching because when you're doing swatching you're pulling a little bit more product on your finger so hence yeah if that makes sense <laughs> I, I hesitated because it wasn't clicking <laughs> it wasn't clicking my head wasn't clicking all right just kind of, just what i figured just what i figured um Okay, you may not be able to see it, but the blue, it is a little patchy. So I had to go in there a couple times, as you saw, like back and forth, back and forth. Um, because when I first applied it, it was streaky. Hmm. And you know what? It isn't this brand's fault by any means. Blues are typically like that, where they can be really finicky in terms of being streaky or patchy. But I can say that it appears that it is buildable and you can actually correct that. So that's a good thing. This is actually a really beautiful color. All right, so let's go into the next shade. Huh. Even though this is a matte, this, um, this brown one, it feels really creamy and smooth. All right, let's go ahead and swatch this one now. Hmm. It's actually really pretty. Anyways, you guys, this is actually really cute. I'm definitely going to use this in a future video. Kind of curious as to how it's going to perform other than actually swatching it. Well, that was my unbagging again for the Ipsy November Glam Bag shipment. Definitely leave a comment below. Let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions about the products that I received. If you do receive Ipsy and you do receive the variation of the regular Glam Bag shipment, what did you get? Did you receive any of these products or did you receive the same variation in Ipsy? So which ones are the hits and which ones are the misses for you? All right, guys, if you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell as well. So anytime I upload a new video, you automatically get the notifications and give my video a thumbs up because I always greatly appreciate it when you guys do. Real quick, before we end the video, I don't smell nothing. <laughs> but then again, the candle is pretty small. I would say it's the size of like two, two and a half tea lights. So I'm not expecting like a powerful like smell but it did smell good when i was smelling it when i actually took the lid off the tin hopefully that makes any sense you guys but it's cute i'm glad i got it it's something different all right you guys but until then make sure to brush your teeth wash your culo and subscribe i will see you guys in my next video take care bye now